Yeah, so we're expecting uh, more than 100 to be vaccinated on this ship alone right here. This being the Conning Dam from Holland America's line here. And we are going to be seeing them docking up here right in front of us. We're going to give you this view here, so stay live on this right now. A cruise ship coming in, causing a bit of a crowd to start forming up. A lot of people excited to see kind of this sense of return to normalcy. It'll be a while before everyone will get to enjoy some cruises on their own, but the way in which we're going to start to get to that will be vaccinating these crew members. So what we know so far with this specific ship, the Conning Dam, the, there will be 126 crew members that are going to receive their first dose of the Pfizer vaccine. Then in about three weeks time, they will be returning to San Diego to get their follow up shot, because as we know with Pfizer and Moderna vaccines, they are going to need that follow up shot as well, too. And then later on today, Sharp's team is actually going to travel by boat. This is Sharp that is vaccinating all of the crew members here. This is pretty cool. They're actually going to go out to the Royal Princess, which is all anchored off the coast of San Diego and they're going to vaccinate their 144 crew members aboard that ship again all in an effort here to make sure that we can return to cruising. CDC guidelines state that at least 98% of crew members and 95% of passengers will need to be vaccinated to resume cruises. It does not appear. Look, this is going to take a while. Uh, we heard that cruising may start back up again in Europe in July, but here in America likely going to take some time here. But the way that we get forward moving towards that having these vaccinations happen, including here with the crew members. And then, of course, the passengers probably going to need to be providing proof there that they have been vaccinated as well, too. So again, back out here live, you'll see the conning dom right here behind us. These crew members getting ready to be vaccinated. We'll be hearing uh, from some of those involved in this process later on this morning around 9 a.m. So be sure to stick with News 8 here for this really promising development today.